Hello, hello, hello. It's your girl DazzleMe77 and I am back with another video. This is going to be a special video because it is a collaboration with the wonderful Miss Robin Cookie. Yes, it is a collab. So if you are here on my channel for the first time, I thank you. If you've come over to my channel from Miss Robin Cookie on this collab, thank you for coming over and checking me out. But either way, you guys, I hope you enjoy and please don't forget to go check her out she has a wonderful channel and she's such a wonderful person so let's get into it so you guys know when this drop happened i was geeked i want everything i want everything in this collection i truly do even the bags that i know are probably too small for me i want them and it's because it's that black on black on black on black. Y'all already know how I do. So let me stop joking around. So today, this was really, really a quick run. I wanted to see how this bag worked. Most of the times when, <clears throat> excuse me, when I pack weekend bags, I don't pack them for weekend carry. Does that make sense? Nah, not really. So what I usually do is I'll have a smaller bag that I could take my bigger items in and put them in, go do what I got to do and come put my stuff back. I very seldom pack for a small carry. I do keep small bags on hand to downsize. I hope that makes sense. But like if I was on vacation or something, it would be totally different because that would be the time that I would pack for a small carry, okay? So just for purposes of this video, this bag was packed for me to put my stuff in, run my errands, come back and put it in my real carry. Make sense? All right, got you. So I will say that how I have this backpack, it is heavy. It is heavy. Home girl is heavy. So what I was planning to do was to run to the gym and do some weights and then go to Target and come on back home. That's all I was trying to do. Um, I did have some stuff that I wanted to do at the gym that necessitated me taking some of the items that you'll see inside, and we'll talk about that. So first things first, this bag is gorgeous. It is that black on black signature um, denim canvas, and I just love this. And as you guys know, retail came out with a line. I want to say it's the same one, but I don't want to believe that retail came out with something and put the same exact stuff in the outlet. I don't want to believe that. So we're going to move on. So if you look right here on the outside, let me turn my computer volume down or off because if not, it's going to be blinging the whole video. I normally do good with that. But anyway, I have this little coin pouch on the outside. I just have it clipped, clipped to the zipper. Let me tell you, bad idea. It dropped like two or three times. So I would advise you if you're going to do that, go ahead and use the loop to hold it on because it did fall for me two times. Also, if you look here, this is the silver. I love it. Um, it is absolutely beautiful. The only thing I have inside of here are my Purell wipes, and that is it, okay? I did take my lotion out, so I'm not even going to try to stuff it back in there, but I was using the Warm and Cozy from Pink, and it has soft vanilla, toasted coconut, and passion fruit. This smells so good. And I just had it stuffed down in there. I'm not even going to try to put it back. But I just wanted to show y'all what I had. On the outside, this is exactly how I had it. I have my phone case sticking out like this. I just prefer for my phones to stick like this, which is why I think I really like Brahmin too. Because they have that cell phone pocket where you're just picking up stuff easily. Can't put my phone in here right now because um, I'm filming on it. But if I wanted to play with that lip, you could zip it closed. I ain't doing all of that, okay? So this is an iPhone, 
iPhone 14 Pro Max. Y'all know this is the case I usually use in my videos. All right, so I did do a short a little while ago. This is actually the piece that I purchased from retail. I had initially purchased it because I wanted the soft tabby in this collection. If I can find a picture of it, I'll show you. But what I did was something I think all of us do that I do not do anymore. <clears throat> I really wanted the soft tabby in the signature denim. And I was waiting for it to go on sale before I purchased it. So guess what happened? It sold out before I could purchase it. And so I didn't get it. Then they brought it back. But when they brought it back, I was too slow and I missed it. And so now it's on the secondhand market, but it's marked way up. And so I missed out. So this time when it came, when this collection came out, I went ahead and paid full price for a lot of the items. Um, I got, what, four items. So I'm not really stressing, but this backpack was $140 when I got it. It is now $122 on the website as of February the 1st. So depending on when you look at this video, the price will be different. So I'm saying all that to say, when it's a collection that you really like, just go ahead and get it. Um, most of the times you can call and they will price adjust, okay? So anyway, this is the piece that was from retail. It is a card case, it has one, two, three. One, two, three. And I was very ambitious today. I was going to put my cards in here so I didn't carry my wallet. But then I was getting lazy. And then that would have meant I didn't go to the gym. Which meant this weight ain't going to take itself off. Which I'm going down the rabbit hole, y'all. But anyway. I don't want to say it's the same collection. But y'all see that stitching? Y'all see that stitching? Y'all see those C's? So, I don't know. And even with the leather, y'all see that? The leather. And then it has like the little bit of the red trim. It's the same glazing, the red. I, I don't want to say that Coach had a, <laughs> a line at retail and brought it to the outlet. Either way, I'm a Coachaholic, so I'm going to purchase it anyway. So I'm not one of those people going to get up here and have a big fit about it. But anyway, I did want to show you that this piece was from retail while this is from outlet. So the other parts to this is that this bag um, has a zipper here. The zipper works really good, as y'all can hear. It does go all the way to the bottom. And it's about an inch and a half, about an inch wide if you're trying to put something in that pocket you do have the double zippers which is super nice um then you have a little d-ring or o-ring on this side that has the coach tag and it's kind of in like a vaqueta colored um tag i love that the thing that i love about this bag is this padded back side um i love it because i think it helps cushion your carry and i will tell you i could tell that this is meant to be in the men's collection but i still believe females can carry it because i mean i'm rocking it but this strap is very thick and very substantial now I will put some mod shots in. I carried this. I prefer to just throw it over my shoulder, which is short, right? You can also lengthen this all the way out and put it over your body and carry it like a backpack. Now, if I was going for a long way, I would do it where it goes all the way over my body and just not my shoulder because it does give you security and you do not feel the weight that way. But if you are putting it over your shoulder or in the front of you, you can feel it. You're gonna feel the weight more in the front than on your shoulder. On the shoulder, it's very comfortable. And I will try to put some my shots in. Um, they're not perfect, you guys, cause y'all know I don't really like being on camera like that. But anyway, I did take some my shots for y'all. You still see it's a very slim pro profile, so it fits very close to your body. So you don't have to worry about that. So that is all about the outside. 
The beauty of having two zippers is that you can maintain the privacy, right? So when you open this, now, again, I just took out of a big carry and put into the small carry. This is like a little wristlet strap I got from Shein. I did cut the strap off. Now, I'm not big on cutting straps off, but I think with the smaller wristlets, that strap is like this long. <laughs> it feels like it's super long and it's in the way, so I did cut it off. And I added this little charm from Shein it has a lock, a key, and a heart with little leopard print or cow print, whatever you think it is. And then it has silver hardware. Now this is something new that I'm trying and I really, really like it. Now I will say that it's heavy, but I like it. So I have this, the denim part of this collection is super light. So the pieces are light, they're not heavy like the leather. But what I have in here is what I need anytime I go somewhere. So I have my iWalk charger. I have my gym keys and my um, sister's charm locker keys for the gym. I have two gym memberships. I'm obsessive. I don't know why. I haven't been going to none since since the whole world thing. But I have my AirPods and then I have both key fobs um, to my car and to my husband's car. So essentially, the reason I was showing y'all that is because this is really all I need. If I'm going, if I have my phone, I have all my cards on Apple Pay, so I don't really need that. I have my charger. All I need is some lip gloss and lotion. So I thought this was nice to start using this. I'm going to see how it works out because I don't have to have my key fob on me as long as it's close to me. When I get to my car, my doors are open and I can start my car. So this is the wristlet that came out with this collection. And if you look right here, you can pretty much see the contents. And you see the zipper comes down pretty far. So again, I just took stuff out of my big carry and put it in here. I could have downsized this to give me more room, but I decided not to. I have um, three masks, some Clorox, and all the wipes you can think of. Um, because I was going to the gym, I usually take a shower there. But I do have my itemizer, and inside of here, um, I have some Can Can. I don't know what it is about Can Can. I just love the smell of it. It's very sweet, and it's just very feminine to me. So I have this pouch inside of there, and then y'all see this. I have a water bottle, and yes. I just put this one in here so y'all can see that a water bottle would fit, which is why this bag was so heavy, okay? So I had a water bottle inside. I also had the full-size wallet that matches inside of here because I don't like switching my wallets a whole lot, um, not for something like this. And so as you can see, it's the traditional setup, big pocket back here, six car slots, gusseted area coin spot this side has two gusseted areas which i really like because i normally carry um my check registers only for my spending account and my house account in here then i have some cash then i have more cards and then i have some coupons back there so this wallet is super nice I did take the wristlet strap off. I had a charm on there, but I took it off when I put it inside this bag, okay? The other side I have in here is my iPad. This is my iPad Pro, and I took it because there were some exercises that I wanted to do um, that I wanted to do the form correctly, and so I brought my iPad. Y'all, I need another case, let me tell you. I bought a new iPad case and I don't like it. I guess because I'm so used to this one because the keyboard just, you don't have to charge it. You don't have to do anything to it. You can adjust the settings on here. I mean, it's just so nice, but I guess as long as my iPad is 
protected. It don't matter that the edges look like that, huh? Well, it ain't going to matter today because I just bought a new one and I took it off. <laughs> I get like that. All right. So in the back, y'all already know I have my personal assistant. Y'all, I love this thing. I love her. So let me show you something about this thing. So in the back of here, I'm not going to show you, but you see I have tabs. I have all different types of things that I have to write down. Um, because this one comes with a lot of note pages. But this is, let me find a, a piece you, I can't write on. Okay. So it just has the calendar. It doesn't have the weekly, which I'm on the go all the time. And so it would be nice if I had monthly, weekly, right? So I've been searching on Amazon and they have one, but it's a Monday start. So that throws me off. I'm a Sunday start person. I have to, even on my weeklies, right? So this is about this bag too, because I thought I was going to do it um, when I went out today. Um, my gym has, it's, it's like a home away from home. You can sit in the locker room and watch TV. You can get in the sauna. We did have a hot tub, but during the whole world crisis thing, um, they cemented it back in, but you can really just go there and make a day of it. So I had my calendar and stuff there too, because, um, I was off today for an appointment. And so I was just trying to get everything done. So I got this one off of Amazon, right? Now, mind you, I said I want it monthly, weekly. So you see on here it says a weekly, monthly planner. So I come in, I look, I'm winning. We got Sunday start. I got some of the major holidays. You know, there's always something, uh, some crazy holidays that you don't think about that they'll list. Okay, then I have the weekly. So I'm doing real good, right? Wonderful, nice. So I could put appointments, gym. I could keep track of the gym, my weight, go to the grocery store. So I could have all of that with me because that's the goal, right? But then when I get to the back, I only have three notes pages. Two, that's not enough. So... I don't want to carry two of them because I think that's too much, but I do love, I think this by far, I've spent so much money on planners, but I think this by far is my favorite planner ever. Um, it's just so convenient. I just, and then like, especially with me having to get vaccinations because it holds so many years, I can look back. I could go on and on about this, but that's what today was. I was going to the gym while I was at the gym um, because they do serve food. I was going to sit and have me a little lunch, but this is the inside of the bag. Um, I was going to have me a little lunch, and while I was having lunch, I was going to utilize that time to plan. Um, I will tell y'all 70% of that happened. <laughs> I ain't going to tell y'all what didn't happen, but 70% of that happened. So I'm happy. Um, but this is the bag. And I'm just so happy because um, my girl Robin Cookie and I decided to do this as a collab, as you guys can see from the title. And um, when she actually got hers before I got mine, and I was just so happy to see that she got it because I was like, oh yeah, I can't wait to see how Miss Robin carries hers because she always carries the iPad with her too. So I know she probably was really happy. So once you finish watching this one or if you've come over from her channel, Thank you. Please go over and view hers and see how she has hers packed. Sorry, sorry about that. I had a little tickle in my throat. But as I was saying, tell me, do you like carrying backpacks like this? Um, are they your full weekly carry though? Or do you just kind of do like I do? Put your items in there and kind of go with it. Um, if you like this um, backpack, please let me know in the comments below. 
Um, and if you have one similar to this, tell me about it. And tell me what you think about the idea of retail coming out with the collection. And then I would say it's been almost a year later. They come out with that same type of collection out the outlet. What are your thoughts on that? So again, I thank you guys so much for viewing my channel. Don't forget to go over and check out Miss Robin Cookie on this one. Um, she is doing a collab as well with me on this backpack. And I just want to say thank her so much. She is such a ray of sunshine. Always so funny. Always picks up the cutest stuff in the stores. So I'm sure you guys will enjoy her video. But as I always say... Remember, 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 be good to others, but be even better to yourself because we cannot pour from an empty cup. Bye-bye.